Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and today we're going to be looking at some car mobile games. I'm not a fan of car mobile games, it seems like a lot of these games are really poorly produced. Sure, W Drive and W Damage are kind of like that, but hey, at least they're interesting. But I don't know, like, like sometimes some of these games could do like the stupidest stuff, you know what I mean? Like, literally just doing a Forza gameplay, putting it in the ad, so, you know, you know what I mean? And, uh, that's why, uh, I'm gonna be taking a look at a few, um, racing mobile games. I think I know some of them. Um, one of them is Hasheria Drifter. Um, I already played that, but, uh, yeah, it's gonna be featured in this video today. It's also gonna be the first one on the list. So, um... Yeah, uh, let's get started. The first game we'll be looking at is obviously Hashuria Drifter. Holy crap, that's way too much text. And also, does that literally say Ditch Among Us in there? I would rather play Among Us than uh, this crappy game. Alright, time to read some critical reviews. Shelton Davidson says, Fake. This game company stole gameplay from Forza Horizon 3 and put it in an ad for their game. David four seven seven one six says, "Quaha," and I can't even read that language, so we're just gonna skip that. Fun and more gibber says, "Trash." They used other games for the trailer, and they used a popular game called Forza Horizon Four for the trailer too. Okay, sorry if it's taking a while to download, but this is a pretty big game, so um, yeah. Wow, look at that. Gaming loading screen. Wow. And look at that sick 400 scene. That's not sick. I was joking, guys. I was literally joking. I was literally freaking joking. You can't. Don't take this literally. I don't like that. Can he drive? Can he drive? You know what DK stands for? Donkey Kong. Drift Kid. Um, did anyone steal the Tokyo Three. Drift reference? So it literally just starts out with this whole entire thing. I start out with a pink S15, and I have to drift up 1,000 drift points. And wow, the physics are kind of horrible. As you can see, I also have this pretty crappy car. Uh, but overall, the graphics actually don't look that bad. But, uh, otherwise, they need to have better cars in this game. Uh, yeah, you can also see that I missed that corner. Also, when it comes to Asheria Drifter, the A86 obviously has to be your first car. It cost 15000 so I ended up with $1,500 left. And in doing so, I, I modded the car a little bit, and removed the rear wing, and, uh, let's just say I lowered it as well. So I hopped into the newest map on Asheria Drifter, and I saw two smoky Nagata Supras. And, um... Later on, I think I did find a Stance Boy S13. It was like crazy camber, all that stuff. But it did look clean. Just without the camber, it already would look good. But with, with the crazy camber, bro. Bro, he just lost me with that. And uh, yeah, there it is. But uh, overall, this game has literally just nothing special going for it. This is literally just Forza Horizon 4 or Forza Horizon 5, but with a Japanese maps. And also, a little bit of crappier graphics. It's on mobile and all that stuff. And, uh, beside with the awful physics and, um, well, you know, the false advertising in this game and the crazy, stupid camber guys, uh, this game isn't really half bad, but it could have been better, though. If I mean, if I made this game and I just removed the stupid false ads and all that stuff, man, and, like, removed all the bugs for the game... All, like, the hacks that have been going on in the game. Um, but, uh, man, I would be a genius. Imagine how crappy these car sounds are. Oh, there it is. Hey, crap boy. You have the most crappy camera in the universe. Ha <laughs> ha. Also, can I notice how crappy these car sounds are? The next game I'll be looking at is Drifting 2 Car Driving Games. Also known as Midnight Drifter. Also, at the same time, uh, hold up. Sorry, I glitched out there. But, um, also, as you can see, there's, there's literally, these pictures are literally just Forza Horizon 4 or something. Probably Forza Horizon 5 as well. 
Tubi says, mad. Coot Car Game bought the mother freaking ads, made me erase it. Now all of the good games are trash just because of the ads. Or, sorry, I had to say off the ads. This game doesn't let me but, says the gibberish name. But anything. I'm playing my game, I just got it. I grind it for three days to get a car, and I buy it, and I restart the game. And I don't have my car, but it also took my money. Adam and Sammy says, too much ads. That's really annoying. I didn't even play it more than five minutes. Also, I could see that this game has 4.2 stars. What? Okay, I could say some of these are probably fake. Or literally just kids who really want to play Forza Horizon 5. And willing to get any bootleg version of the game right in their hands. So, back in the day, you usually get the Mustang Fox body for your first car. But unfortunately, now it's the uh, BMW E30. Pretty interesting. I hopped into an online server and literally almost everyone was literally the BMW E30 that I have. And wow, look at this. The physics are literally horrible. I could see why it's addicted to kids because, um, honestly, because, you know, they love, they love the arcade physics. They've never been in the, you know, the realistic racing stuff, you know what I mean? And, uh, yeah, and wait a second. Don't tell me they sold a famous Monaco Formula 1 map. And, um... Yeah, I literally go, gone around this whole entire track, and, uh, yeah, this is literally just a rip-off of Monaco. This is literally just Monaco, just, you know, but apparently not with Formula 1 cars. It's pretty much wider, her road, and, uh, it's got, like, t like, you know, like, no, like, little markings on it, instead of being, like, a real racetrack, and, yeah, I can't believe it. They did rip off Monaco, um... Yeah, but overall, this game literally has nothing special going. And again, actually, you know what? I changed my mind. This game is bad. This is literally one of the worst games we played yet. But hey, maybe the next game will be worse. I don't know. Maybe it's more high graphic. Maybe we'll be surprised. But um, yeah, um, this is literally just Hashiria Drifter, but with like the lowest graphics possible and more horrible physics. Don't get it. Holy crap, I was just about un to uninstall Midnight Drifter, but apparently we're going to the next crappy racing game of the worst racing games yet. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, we're down with the Rebel Race, and this is literally just the last game we're going to do since this video is getting alone. After one of the characters talking to me for a very long time, I went for a little race. And wait a second. Oh my goodness, spray. Don't tell me this is literally just going to be a Need for Speed knockoff or something. Because I can already tell where this is going. And also, my Sylvia looks very bone stock and all. And somehow I'm beating everyone since I have a tune on my car. Uh, but, uh, yeah. That race was something special. Then that person told me I need to upgrade resources. Wait a second. Don't tell me they ripped off some feature that's in Forza. They literally just ripped off something from Forza. I can't believe it. Man, we're on the final game here, and they already ripped off something Forza has. Man, I can't believe it. I actually found a real Forza ripoff. And for that fact, there's no not even Nitro in Forza, so I guess they also ripped off Need for Speed as well. Uh, yeah, again, this game has nothing special going for it. Um, this is really just Forza, just reskinned. But yes, guys, that is the end of this video, yeah, we looked at three horrible racing games. Hashiria Drifter, Midnight Drifter, but unfortunately named Drifting 2 right now. And uh, Rebel Racing, which I got an ad for. And that gave us luck to uh, download that piece of junk. But, um, yeah, um, that's it for today's episode. And I am starting to find this a face channel soon. So, um, yeah, stay tuned. But anyway, guys, that's it for today's episode. Subscribe! Dude, is this a super? Super. Super. Really nice super. I love this. I like that. <laughs>